Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of my Darkness Falls for Alpha 20 series. It is the morning of day 59 and I haven't even made it back to the house yet. I was going to stop and try and mine some iron here, but there were so many zombies around I decided to just like clear them out. And by the time I finished clearing them out, the freaking sun came up. So yeah, I mean I did run my mouth a bit last night before we got uh, got to go home so I didn't even get the chance to mine any iron which is unfortunate but that's fine we're gonna head back to the house right now drop all this stuff off I want to get this titanium moving uh, maybe we get a bit of it moving uh, I better kill these guys I'll get a bit of it moving not necessarily all of it what has got you so angry over here Alright, so we'll get some of it moving. I don't want to do too much because if we can if we can get down to that bunker and get that done, then um, we can make a fusion forge. And I think the fusion forge is more efficient than the advanced forge when coming to making the titanium. I'm not 100% sure. If you know, let me know in the comments. But I'm pretty sure it's a bit more uh, robust when it comes to doing that. So much like the uh, advanced forge gives you twice as much resources as the big forge does, I think the fusion forge works a little better with like titanium and uranium. I, well, I know it's the only thing that can do uranium and plutonium, but uh, all right, let's get just this, this stuff put away here. All right, that's that done. Let's actually break this plastic up here too before I forget. It won't be much, but I mean, we got to keep on it because if we don't, we're going to be in a lot of trouble. Been doing a lot of consideration of what I want to do for my next uh, Seven Days to Die series, and I've, I've been giving Undead Legacy a look, and because uh, Guns, Nerds, and Steel is actually doing one on that, it looks really interesting, and I agree 100% when he says it's a very, very polished mod. It looks really, really polished. So there's, I, w I wish I could. I mean, I haven't seen the end game in that, so I don't know. What, I can't really comment on that, but I wish it had kind of a mix of Darkness Falls slash. Like, I wish Darkness Falls was more that way, where you could actually pick up anything and use anything. It's kind of cool that way, but I don't know. We'll see. Um, okay, so that being said, let's see what we got going on here. Uh, we got some bullet tips. More bullet tips. We got our jars for making plastic, some cement. And we got some of that going before I left. And that's the... Irrigation, there's nothing in here. I'm gonna leave my radiation ready mods in for now because we might go back to the wasteland today. I'll see. Uh, let's get, I think we just make the regular coil rounds here. We are missing what? Bullet casings, which I know I've got a bunch of. Make a couple thousand. And I don't think we got the iron to make more casings. Let's get that started. I think we're looking pretty good for ammo now. I've been staying on it for the past little while, so I think we're okay in that regard. We got enough coil, a couple couple thousand more coil rounds here. We just need the casings. Got a little bit of casings. I could take some of this apart for making coil shotgun rounds. I really should check at the base how much we have. We'll go over there today. Uh, we don't have very much iron here, do we? Not a whole lot. I think we got to mine iron today too. All right, let's do this. We got to keep this working. So let's grab you, 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 and we want to do. Can only do. I don't know. I don't know how much I lose in the overflow here, but I'm going to go with 120. I know Darkness Falls does a pretty good job of. Uh, sticking anything in the overflow into your inventory, but I don't think it sticks everything. You you save some of it, but not a lot. So we got a lot of cornmeal here. So that should keep us. That's about a thousand plastic in total, roughly somewhere around there. Let's just use one of these guys. I should make some. Uh, I need to make food and stuff too. You know what? Let's make another friggin' oven. Where's my? I need electrical parts, forged iron. I think it's pipes. I don't know if we need, I think we need a battery. 
Oh, it's really taxing my brain. I know we need electrical parts. Mm. Let's do it over here. So, O, V. Yeah, it's not. Uh, cooking pot and cooking grill. Well, that's easy enough. Wait, do we have those? We do. Yeah! Thinking ahead. How long is that going to take? Four minutes, huh? Well, we're not going to have it done today. Well, it'll be done today, but I'm not going to be here to take it out of there. Okay, get that going. Let's grab the sand that we have. We got a bunch of sand now. That's good. A little bit of extra of that. Stone we're doing well on, so let's get some more concrete moving. I got to keep this going because if I don't, it'll be an issue. Get that mixing. Let's get... A couple of hundred concrete shapes started. Save some of this here for repairs around here if we need it. How are we doing? Pretty good. All right, titanium. What else can I make out of titanium? I, mean, I can make an axe and a shovel, but they're not that... Like, my axe and my shovel are one-hitting everything anyway. Well, my shovel's one-hitting the dirt. Even the titanium pickaxe one-hits dirt now, so I don't have to worry about that. And the axe, well, whatever. It's not really a big deal. Um, no, I think we're good. I think we need iron. I think we got to do that today. So let's go over to where I was before. Actually, what day is it today? 59. When did the trader restock? Oh, I can't remember. We're going to be close to him anyway. Let's take a few things to sell. Right, I'm not going to take a lot. I'll just take a few things. Just in case. Re replenish our money a bit. Alright, so do I need anything else from here? Not waiting on anything, am I? Now that's going. Those are going. I should have stuff going in the furnaces, but I don't have... Anything to put in there. It's got to be iron. Now, I remember scoping these places out earlier. I think this is... This is coal and nitrate, and this one up here was the iron. This is where I was parked last night. It's that wolf I killed. Come on, lady. Pick me up. There you go. So it was right here. Somewhere. So let's um, put you down. I mean, I don't really need to. It's not like these guys are going to do anything to me, but if I can just ignore them while I dig, uh, that would be good. So yesterday the Wandering Horde came kind of at the end of the day, which is nice. Because that means it'll come at the end of the day again tonight. I don't have to worry too much about it dropping in on my head here. What was that? Oh, a rabbit or something probably. Oh, it's a chicken. I don't know why these they does that weird kind of like it dies and then skids across the map in the direction it was going. Like it still has momentum or something. It's kind of bizarre. There better be iron down here. There it is. Ooh, we can almost one hit iron with this thing. With a power attack. What about a regular attack? It's still two hits, so let's go regular. So as far as generating heat goes... I got a question for you guys. I don't know the answer to this. I just I'm wondering. So I know mining causes heat in the in the chunk that you're in. But here's the question. So is the amount of heat you generate per hit based on the damage you do or is it get I know it is based partially on the block you're hitting. So obviously it'll be less heat if you're hitting sand than it will be if you're hitting stone or iron. I get that, but is it, so like if I right click here, hit that with, for one, is that like, let's say a fixed amount of 10, and then this would be 10, 20, or is it per block? So regardless of how many times I hit this block, it will just only generate a fixed amount of heat. I'm interested to know that, because I, I, it's, it would help me figure out, because I've been 
There's been times where I'll get a screamer, like I'll be in a fresh chunk, and I'll get a screamer after about like six to 10,000 iron, and then sometimes it's after like three stacks of iron, so like 18 to 20,000. It's very random, so, and I haven't been monitoring like me, like with the blocks I've been hitting to generate heat, so I don't know. And I know it's less if I'm crouching, which is why I always crouch. Well, I crouch for two reasons. One, because it's loud, right? And that's not very good for the series. You don't want to be hearing me hitting these things at full, full loudness. And then it's because it generates less heat. I think it's like 30% less heat. I'm not 100% sure on the percentage, but it's still a fair amount. Maybe I go until we generate a screamer. So that's three in a bit. So this is this is about the time when I would generate a screamer, roughly. And that's with a steel pickaxe. Because I generally don't do bulk mining like this unless I'm at steel. Right? There's no point in trying to... I mean, you... Once again, depending on how you're playing, where you're playing, grabbing um, Uh, a whole ton of steel with using an iron pickaxe. If you want to do that and you got the time, feel free. But like I generally don't grab like lots of, of uh, sorry, lots of iron until I've got steel tools because it's just so much slower when you don't have steel tools. So that screamer should get killed by the junk turrets. As long as she doesn't scream while I'm in here. I think she's out there, but I think she's caught in the barbed wire. Oh, that's a uh, elk. Shut the fuck up. Oh, for fuck's sakes. It shouldn't be too bad, I don't think. Let's see what we're up against here. Yeah, not too bad. Oh, that's a demon. Two demon cops. Alright, we gotta take care of the idiots first. Piece of me. Where am I getting that from? Shit. This is what I mean about when we go to the wasteland, how it's going to be a problem. That guy's hanging in the tree. Oh, no, that's a, that's a, uh, all right, well, I'm not sure why they keep coming. I didn't see a second, uh, oh, man, that was bad. I did not see a second, um, screamer, but I'm assuming there was. Yeah, we're making a hasty retreat out of there. I don't have the juice for that. There's no way. We got the iron we needed. Man, I'm kind of glad it came out of that hole when I did, though. That's brutal. So 25 shotgun rounds, 130 of the 762. All right, not bad. Could have been worse. Let's go get ourselves fixed up here. At least, the, at least I know now. It's still roughly about three stacks of iron before the screamer gets called in. So I can do three stacks over there once the heat dies down. I can knock out three stacks and then we'll just leave it. Then I don't have to worry about a screamer. I think that's probably the best way to do it. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah. Okay, let's get this iron going. So I want to make uh, 600 in each of these. Actually, we don't. We want to make 600 in the first three. Get 600 going in here. Yeah, so we're at a really crucial stage of the game now where i got to be very careful here. I can't tip the scales too much. Let's make 4k casings in there. So we'll be ahead on casings. Ah, there's someone down there wrecking shit. Um, yeah, I gotta be very careful because if I'm not, what'll end up happening is the mobs will begin to outpace what I can actually successfully defeat. That um, succubus was a perfect example of that. So I think we're gonna have to do that, uh, the bunker. After the next horde, we fix the... Hopefully this... I'm going to try and... I'll run the horde so it's minimal. And then I'll try and fix the base right afterwards. And then once the base is fixed... Um, God, this is such a... Once the base is fixed... Um, we'll just head down there. Let's go ahead and use one of use. Use one of these guys. I think I need a splint for this. Yep, get that fixed. I'm not going to use the first aid kits. I'm pretty sure I can make first aid kits. I got to start drawing my blood though. I've only got nine blood bags. I've been shying away from doing it, but I guess I can't anymore. Now, there's also the improved med kit too, which I think I should be looking into. We lost a bit of wellness on that last uh, fight. Um, okay. So, I'm going to go to Jen. Let's restock on ammo first. Okay, we're looking pretty good. Restocked on ammo. Actually, our junk turrets reloaded. I don't think I reloaded them. I'm going to have to start carrying around these guys. Murky water in my uh, thing down here. What do you provide? Little health, a bunch of water. Let's use you. All right, now, I think we just need a little bit more junk turret ammo. We can get the hell out of here. Yeah, we're good there. Uh, yeah, that's actually not too bad. I want to bring some more. I, I don't remember... Yeah, I don't remember when was the last time we went down to see her. I think it was like day 52 or something, or 53. So she probably was either one of those two days. She should have restocked. So I think it's every six days she restocks. Come on, buddy. Get off my walls. Oh, we're not going down to the wasteland today. I think we spend the day figuring out what we're going to do with the uh, the farm here. I want to do, like I said, an in indo gro indoor grow op here. So I'm going to have to reinforce all the corners. And probably take out the windows and reinforce all those. And then probably put some pillars up here, and then right above here is where the where the uh, farm is going to be. And I'll put plates under it and stuff so that it protects it from zombies. But I think that's probably what we're going to do. We'll reinforce this. I'll finally close this off, and we'll make a new way in. And I might I might harvest the bodies out here. I don't know. The lawn isn't that bad. I mean, it's well fertilized. Maybe we keep it like this. I don't know. Oh, you know what we do need though. Besides killing that guy. Because we do need to go... Man, I'm having flashbacks of those two demon cops. I couldn't even kill one of them with the uh, M4. Yeah, we're going to have to, like, step our game up here. Okay, um... What was I doing? Oh, yeah, getting gas. we got a bunch of gas. We can refuel the, uh... That's what we bought yesterday. Refuel the truck. Oh my god, they just never stop coming, do they? Off of my house. Alright, 
Alright, what are we at? 83%. Not bad. Alright, let's go this way. Head down to Jens. Ooh, almost threaded the needle on that one. Let's see if we can get it on this one. Ah, oh, the sign's gone. Oh, it's barely gone on that one. Excuse me. Oh, can we jump that? Oh, we can too. And then we can run into a tree. Oh, hang on a second. Yeah, you better run. I know I said I was going to test out that skyscraper, but I don't think... I don't know. You know what? Let's go to Jen's place. Oh, let's see. This guy's got a bag for us. Oh, I missed. I should probably grab the uh, oranges here, too. Since we don't have our trees up and running yet. Yeah, I'm already getting lag here. Like, I don't think going downtown is going to be a good idea. Ooh, let's not wreck the trees. Alright, I'm interested to see if this guy's still up here fighting. And if that dog is going to die again. Oh, you're still here. Oh, yeah, you are. That guy, I don't know where that guy went. He went into space. Now, let's see if this dog dies again. He keeps dying every time I pass here. No, he's gone now. He's gone. He died for real last time. Oh, wait, there he is. Nope, he's dead again. Sorry, buddy. He keeps dying every time I pass here. I feel so sorry for him. Look at this stuff. Shit drawing in. You know, it's funny. My graphics card died right during the, uh, the, uh, graphics card dirge where you couldn't get them at all. Like, or not dirge, but you know what I mean, where it was like, you couldn't get graphics cards anywhere. And my graphics card died, so I, like... I went with a newer model graphics card with 8 oh, gigs of RAM instead of going with an older with 16. I should have went with the older one, but whatever. Yeah, I think... Oh, maybe not. I can sell some stuff here. Excuse me, Jen. Did you guys make holes in this place? Is that what the deal is? Or were you living here with Jen? There's a hole. Fuck off. Don't make me waste a round on you. Two rounds. Three rounds. Made me waste those rounds. Alright, where were we? Before we were so rudely interrupted. I don't mean to point my shotgun at your face, but, uh... You know, I can't trust anybody in the, in the pocky clips. Alright, you can sell a bunch of this stuff, but not a lot. Alright. Not bad. She bought about half of our stuff, which is pretty good. So we got 130,000. Now, uh, the only thing I need out of you... Uh, she restocks in two days, so I don't think she's got anything here for us. Nah, we've already been here. I think it was 56 she restocked, which is probably why we're uh, not finding anything. Alright, well... I hope you get feeling better. I'm only going to feel better once you have that laser workbench. Put in an order for me. Well, right, well, let's go down here and see if I can actually do this. Downtown, downtown. Damn it, I was getting up for enough speed to make a jump here, and that guy had to get in my way. Alright, where are we? Where is this place? Right here. Oh, is it the Cracker Book building? What is this building? It is. Cracker Book HQ. I mean, it's a bit laggy. The only thing I can think of is that there's, like, it's not too bad here if I'm looking away from this building, and as soon as I look at this building, it's really bad. Alright, let's see if it's close. It's on this side up here somewhere. We're supposed to go up, I think. I 
I should have waited to start this. Damn, well. You know, here I said I wasn't going to go in here, and here I am. Being stupid. Get off my fucking truck, God. That was a, that was a good jump. I just about swallowed spit there. Oh, you're fast. Crisis reminds me of playing video games in the old days. Back in the days when it didn't matter how chunky your graphics card was, you just played anyway because it was too awesome to not play. Alright, we got a couple more. Let's not wait for them though, we got stuff to do. Okay, not in the first floor. Not on this floor. Um, let's just smoke whoever we can here. Yeah, see, even this way's not bad. Still gotta go up, though. To where? Like, right here. Can I... I'm gonna do something stupid. Because, oh, that's... Ah, you tricky bastards. That's a good uh, good solution for not being able to nerd pull up anymore. Is uh, building ledges like that. But we can still do this. And now these things are connected to that wall. Nope, still up. Ooh, is it on the roof? I think it is. It gets laggier and... <gasps> no! Oh, shit. Well, that ends that. What did I bang my head on? Oh, the overhang. No. The support. Does it really end that, though? That's... A I need a cast. And I can't leave the property. I don't think I'm going to find one in here, so... Oh man, this is bad. I'm going to do something stupid. Oh my god, I can't even jump that. Okay. There we go. Now. Let's try again. Good thing I got 123 frames. Alright, we'll do this. Look at the hours going up on my foot. I didn't take much damage from the fall, though. Okay, so this next one... Yeah, I hit my head on that. So let's do... Which just was like Minecraft, where you could kind of like sneak onto the edge and not fall off. All right, we'll do this. Oh, this is a bad idea. This is a really fucking bad idea. That's a dog. Do you think I could survive? You know what we could do? God, this is such a bad idea. Have I said it's a bad idea yet? It seems like it's a really bad idea. So I don't know if they can... I don't think they can reach me from there. So they might... Oh, this is a really bad idea. Please, don't let there be demons. That dog decided to go for a long drop, and there goes a demon. There's lots of demons. Yeah, that was a bad idea. Alright, let's not do that and say that we did.
let's pretend that we went and did that one and we were successful and now we're just heading home because damn all right can we still go down we can still go down oh uh, i don't i don't know if i want to look at them all just coming off the roof and going back up nope they're coming up the ow Can you get across? I don't think you can. That stops your regen. Nice. Comes another one. Shit. Where are you going? Nice. Might still be able to do this. Two down. We're gonna get a fucking screamer and that'll be it. This is not how I wanna die in this series. Where's that other bird? All right, frame rates are clearing up a little bit. Let's, uh... Do that. I don't know if the Molotovs really add a lot of heat. He's taking a bit of damage, but not a lot. The fact that he regens is bad. Alright, we got two of the demons down here. I don't remember how many there were. Okay, you're still up there. Can we get you to come out? There's a demon, like, right there. They're not going to come out, though. Man, this is such a stupid idea. Can I get... Nope. Do you think I could toss a Molotov up there? I mean, if I put my junk turrets down, maybe I can get some leeway on these guys? I don't know. Let's do that. Is he banging down or is he asleep? Did he reset? That's the question. Oh, I'm gonna do something stupid. Okay, I want to make sure there's a few of these down here like this. Just in case I fall, I can kind of manipulate myself back down onto these blocks. Oh, you were stuck in the block. Ooh, that's problem solved. Ooh, we may still have a shot at this. As long as I don't punk myself off the building. Alright, well. I don't think... The zombie's down below. Yeah, she was stuck in a block. Oh, she broke out there. <gasps> no! 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 Oh, fuck me. <laughs> did I... I did the same thing. I think I hit the same block. I'm here. Good thing we don't have a horde tonight. I don't think anyone's going to be interested in, like... Oh. Well, hello there. So, if I go ahead... Where do I want the fight to, to be, though?
Probably on here. Now, can I... Nothing above me, right? This is so stupid. If there's a demon over there, I'm fucked. Shit, that didn't get over. That did. Oh, he's not doing anything. They're not doing anything. Why aren't they doing anything? They must be on a trigger. They must be up there must be glass over there. Let's just grab this to make sure we're done. Where's the gyrocopter when you need it, man? I think the main loot's downstairs anyway. I'm not gonna stay for I won't stay for the main loot. That's just a little too much cheating. Alright, well, don't fall. I'm not leaving these behind. Oh man, the lag all of a sudden. That better not be a wandering horde. That would kind of be par for the course though at this point. Oop. Oh, damn it. I want these loot bags out here too. No frame left behind. Oh, somebody's coming off the roof. Oh, no, somebody else is coming off the roof. What did that tree ever do to you, buddy? I mean, I'm fucking you up, but that tree ain't. Oh man, it sounded like they were on the ledge. I want these loot bags. Don't get greedy, man. But I'm gonna get greedy. Really? Really? The lag is so bad, Ratchet. All the stuff that I don't need. A map. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. I'm taking that as a win. Alright, we gotta go to Bob now, right? Oh my god. That's it for downtown. I can't do these anymore. There's just no way. This lag is just too bad for me. can't get through here. Excuse me. What is it I'm stuck on? The post. Well, that's our first tier 5. It didn't go too bad, I guess. Could have been worse. Alright, Bob better have something good for us. And he better buy some of our shit, because if he doesn't, I'm going to be angry. Actually, you know what? Let's go... Rather than using our own supplies, let's go use the uh, White River supplies here. I think what I want to do is I want to buy whatever aloe cream she has as well. How's it How going? May I serve you? Oh, you can fix me up. That's what you can do. Let's buy... One of you... One of you, and all of you. Don't need the You're honey. Welcome. All right, let's use you. Didn't get infected though. That's uh, kind of a miracle. There we go. Back to the full speed. Are you coming to the door too? Or what are you doing? Hurry up! Step right up. Step right up. You better have something good for me, buddy. Howdy. 
Really? Well, that sells for a good chunk. And we need these. We'll take those. Uh, can I see your inventory? Question is, will you buy this stuff? Now, I didn't see a wandering horde today. Oh, we don't want to sell that. Uh, that's not bad. Alright, um... Uh, do you have anything close by? Oh, we want to go to Tier 3. Because that's the, uh... Northeast clothing store. That's why I'm asking you for a helping hand. I can't thank you. Yeah, anything. we'll go there. I don't know. Oh, shit. They almost got through that door. Forged iron? Nope. Let's see if he's got something to fix his door for him. That's not really even a door. All right, you got forged iron. I don't know if you do. Uh, nope, resources. You do. We'll take I'll all of it, fix your door with what I can, and keep the rest. All right. There you go. Now we shouldn't have to worry about that for a while. Hey, buddy. See ya. Yeah, so I think in the next series idea I'm going to do, do with a compo pack POI. I've even toyed around with doing a series with no hordes. Like turning up all the difficulty so that Feral Sense is on all the time. And, um... Feral Sense on all the time, put the zombies on jog. Uh, maybe insane difficulty, I don't know. It just means that we have to get headshots a fair bit. Which I think we're more than capable of doing. It just early on it becomes, it's tough, right? Because the zombies can, like, I mean, if you don't get headshots, you're pretty much screwed, right? Oh, for, for sake. I mean, it's nice of you to bring some stuff, but... Oh, Christ. Who's out here? Don't need him. Didn't call him for a mechanic. Oh, my God. Really? We didn't get that wandering horde. Throat shot. I think he's still alive, though. Groin shot. That wandering horde might come tonight. Base ca I mean, best case scenario, if that wandering horde shows up while we're inside. Oh, for... Like, I mean, at least they're telegraphing that they're here, but... Could you please at least telegraph before I get on the ramp? Alright, well... Now do I have peace and quiet? There's still somebody banging on something somewhere, but it's not in my compound. It's some ooh, somewhere else, so... Oh shit, I spoke too soon. I gotta just learn to stop talking. Alright, well that's it for today I guess. Ah uh, man. So tomorrow we're definitely getting a horde. That'll be interesting. Um, we're definitely getting demons tomorrow so I don't know what we're gonna do. We got pork and shotgun. Like, I think I have to gear up and be ready to go down to, uh, that military bunker right after the horde. We gotta go. It's not gonna be right, like, the day after the horde, it'll be the day after that. Hopefully, with fingers crossed, we don't get a horde that day. If we do, we'll abandon the mission and come back. Um, but we should know before we get there whether or not we're gonna have a horde. And then, uh, we'll clear that bunker... 
I'll make sure I bring stuff down to make a, a uh, laser workbench. We'll make one down there. Then we can make as many as we want up here. We'll make a fusion forge. And then um, hopefully, then all we have to do is deal with the horde at the base. I'll get the base updated. Uh, most likely what I'll do is we'll do the, the second to last horde I do will be me on foot. To see if I can actually survive in the town here. We'll fight in the town. I'll, I'll level up parkour. And we'll go through the town. I'll try and survive the horde on foot. And then if I make it through that. Well, I'll probably make it through that one regardless. Even if I die on that one. That's fine. It'll be a comedy of errors. Me trying to get my bag back. Because the horde just keeps going all night. Right? It doesn't matter. So worst case scenario. We, we run out to the horde base. And we, do, we fight the horde out there. And then the final uh, horde will be to see if that horde base can withstand a 64 zombie max alive horde as it stands. Now I'll get it upgraded as best I can. Uh, I don't want to go and cheat and, and like go to day 7,000 like 7, or whatever that is. I'll just build it as best I can with what I have. Crank it up to 64 and then just see what the hell happens. I got a feeling it's going to get completely trashed. But um, if they don't break through the hatches, then we will be fine. Because I can leave the shutters closed pretty much, I think, most of the time. Uh, the only thing that's going to be the problem is the succubi on the roof. So we're only going to have one junk turret for that. And I'll have all the, um, I'll have the Mark turrets, uh, Mark IV turrets up there. So hopefully that'll be able to deal with the succubus. But if they come like six, seven at a time, we're, we're pretty much screwed. It'll be over. They'll tear it through the roof and then it will be on foot for the rest of it. But we'll see how it goes. I'm going to end, it, end this episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And please drop your comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.